Hey everybody, what's happening? It's UM, and uh, today I'm going to do a review on Generation 1 Throttlebot Goldbug. Now, there's really, really not a lot I can say about him. He very simplistic transformation. He's a wind up and go, you know. That's what he does. Here's him next to the G1 <coughs> Bumblebee. Here's Bug Bite. So as you can see, he's just a smidge, a very, very small amount bigger than uh, the original Bumblebee. Okay. <clears throat> Here he is when compared to Classics Bumblebee. As you can see, he's quite a bit smaller than Classics Bumblebee. And here he is when compared to the movie Bumblebees. <coughs> There's a premium and classic uh, Camaro Bumblebee. So as you can see, he's not big. I mean, when deluxe figures are dwarfing him, you know that he's not that huge. Alright, very easy transformation. Flip his arms out, and you can see his little fingers. Best thing to do is bring this down. Just like that. Fold that down. There you go. Do a zoom in on his face for me. Nice figure. He's still retains his wind up and go which is the extent of his everything you know so I'll go ahead and just a quick comparison to see there you go not very big when, when he's uh, when a mini bot dwarfs his robot size, you know that he's not very tall. Well, I hope that you guys enjoyed this very short review. This is sort of like a redo from just like my Flywheels one. It was a very early review I did, and uh, I took it off just for quality reasons. Hope it's a little bit better. All right, this is UM. Guys, take it easy. Bye.